this is Raven from Raven's Reviews and welcome back to the channel. Oh my gosh, I love you guys so stinking much. I hope wherever this video found you, it found you so well. And today we are going to be doing the thumb. Femi Beauty Method Poly Gel Application. Can we hear the applause? <sighs> <laughs> I am just so excited to be able to play with poly gel again. So let's get right into it with the thumb. Throughout this video, I am going to be putting in codes, discount codes for all of my charm sisters uh, so that if you guys are making any purchases, you can save yourself some coins. So you can feel free to use code MAMA when getting any Medusa orders for a free gift. And I actually won this top coat Z in a giveaway that was on Mama Does Nail Live. Uh, Mama Does Nails Live. I'm so sorry. <laughs> and um, it just, this has been one of my favorite top coats. This and Madame Glam's No Wipe top coat are my ultimates. I find that this one is like glass, so I really wanted to use this specifically for the Femi Beauty method because you are working from like the top, um, back, like you're working backwards kind of thing, if that makes sense. It's a really cool way instead of building the nail in layers, you're, you're starting with the top. So I quickly, it's already cured, and now I'm going in with Flamingo. And for any of your McCart purchases, if you'd like to use my code Raven's Nail Bar, you can get 15% off. And every single beautiful product that I used in this video, I made sure to include in the description box below. Oh, so how I even came to be doing this video right now is a huge thanks to Mama Does Nails. At least I could say it right this time. Oh my goodness. <laughs> She really reinvigorated my passion in poly gel. I have had a really love-hate relationship. It was the very first products I ever tried and I was madly in love and then I ended up getting a really bad allergy to it and I had to completely discontinue using any kind of nail products for over a month on my own hands which was so difficult. And whenever I am using acrylic dust, um, like I'm in contact with acrylic dust, or poly gel dust, I do have reactions. So you're gonna see in this video, I mask up, I make sure I have, you know, my safety glasses and <laughs> my gloves just to eliminate any reactions. But I really love this Femi Beauty method. Thank you so much, Mama, for showing me this, first of all. And thank you, Femi, for creating this. You are a genius. Oh my goodness, especially for somebody like me that wants minimal filing, this is a game changer. So I'm going in with my slip solution, which is rubbing alcohol, and I am just gonna pat, pat, pat for the gods. But earlier on, you saw me use that dotting tool. That was basically to create that marble effect. And it's really important for you to be like conscious of what the front of your nail looks like, because sometimes right now, you could have your desired effect and then turn it around and it's not what you want. So just make sure you're double checking that it, your vision is coming to life. This is gonna be a watch me work style video, but I will be popping in throughout the video to explain some of the techniques I'm using. But I just, I can't thank you mama enough for reinvigorating my passion with poly gel and showing me this method because oh my goodness this is a huge game changer especially for somebody with allergies like myself oh i'm just sending you the hugest hug and i apologize for all the tongue twisters words are hard this morning <laughs> i'm just gonna sip my coffee but i will be back and i just thank you so so much for tuning into this video and for all the love and support you guys are the greatest. This is the most beautiful nail family and I am so grateful for you. Oh my.
my gosh, recently I've been watching Sabrina again and I had to include Salem with that file. It always makes me think of Nails by Mermaiden, but I could not resist to pop that in there. It was so stinking precious. So with this thumb, um, I found that there were certain gaps that I did not like near the cuticle. So I do go in with a small bead just to secure that area so everything is flush and looking perfect. So now that we have our tie-dye fantasy secured, we are going to do the filing, which for me is one of the most satisfying parts of nail art. And I was so impressed, like again, using the Femi Beauty method, there was such minimal dust. And um, I did use my beautiful dust extractor. That is one of my most favorite birthday gifts. Thank you so much, Envy. Oh, I don't know what I would do without it. It helps eliminate dust in the air and all of those allergens. Um, but for some of the filing, I did put the dust collector away. But just because you don't see it here does not mean I did not use it. <laughs> I just wanted to speed up some of the filming because if not, we would be, you know, we'd be filing for days. Not that I had very much filing, but again, anything that's repetitive, I do like to cut out so that these videos can be beautiful and smooth. So there is a couple areas on here that had a few um, air pockets. Uh, I do do a design so that that's completely covered up. Uh, but I did learn like the four nails that you see before you that was not the thumb. Um, we did on a live on Wednesday with Mama Does Nails. And the hugest thing for me is that I was really just getting my footing again with Polygel. So I have completely figured out um, how to kind of pop those bubbles so they don't have Happen. Um, but for the sake of this video, I did not want to, you know, lose those gorgeous nails. So uh, the, the tiny bubble is so small. So I just make sure that we do gorgeous art and everything just comes together with the magic. So we're going in with a gorgeous Kiara Sky buffer, buffing, buffing to perfection so that it can be ready for the nail art. Now you guys know how passionate I am about Madame Glam and I wanted to put my two Charm Sisters codes. Oh my goodness. So um, the first code is Mama Does Nails with a Z 30 underscore one. And then the second code is Priya30. I'm gonna put all of that, all of those codes in the description box below, but I was just so excited. Oh my gosh, when when I just heard, first of all, that um, they reached out to my sister, I just lost it because Mama is so talented and they've been working with um, our other charm sister Priya for quite some time now. So it just like warmed my heart to like to the moon and back. So I had to make sure I included those um, those codes for you. I feel like more than anything, this video was a love letter to my sisters because I use so many goodies that I have gotten like from those queens and I just feel so blessed. I am going in with a rainbow hollow cat eye from the beautiful Mama D and I just have to thank my charm sisters. Thank you, Mama D. You guys are my family and I just, I don't know what I would do without you beautiful humans and all of my nail sisters and family. You guys mean the world. So I just, I'm reaching out, giving you a huge raven hug, and I hope that you're having the most beautiful day. So 
This is where I realized I went on way too thin and there was just, the particles were not reacting. So I do go in with a thicker dollop of the rainbow uh, cat eye, just so that we can actually have that gorgeous shimmer. But I am impressed when you apply it so thin that it basically looks like a shimmer. So I just, this is by far, like this is definitely one of my favorite products that I've ever swatched or looked at. Like it's just so dynamic and I just can't wait to try reflective gel. I've never tried reflective polish before. So it just, I'm praying that 2022 is gonna be filled with all of the firsts. And uh, oh, you can see right here as I'm moving it, it really begins to react. It's so gorgeous. Ooh, do you see that? Oh my gosh, I was just in heaven. I also wanted to take a moment. Um, I have never used e-nail couture. Like the only tips I've been able to use were these gorgeous oval ones that mama sent in an international bestie box. So this is the first time that I've actually been able to try a longer set and I am madly in love. Like I already thought Max's products were the business, but these are the one, two, three go coffin, clear coffin. And I am gooped, gagged, get, like, just like bamboozled. No, not bamboozled. I'm just shocked. Like, I just can't get over how strong they are. They're so beautiful. Like, this was just such a dream to work with. So I also include um, Mama's Code as well for e Couture for 10% off for anything that you need. So I do know that I did throw a lot of codes out there. Um, so if any of you weren't able to see it, like if it was too quick or um, all of those information and codes will be in the description box below. So going in with the perfect white, I just created some gorgeous marble veins and I am just dipping in with some rubbing alcohol and a little bit more perfect white to give like a smoky effect.
Okay, so this is where the blingathon begins. So I, and you guys know, bling is definitely out of my comfort zone, but I love it so much. So I try to channel my inner Mama Does Nails and do the best bling placement I could. And I was envisioning a gorgeous ring, like a band um, going across the nail. So this is, this is the creation. Now that we have secured our gorgeous tie-dye fantasy design, I am just gonna go in with top coat Z and seal in all of that artwork so that we can truly get that. It's, it's like a mixture of a stone effect and a cool tie-dye effect. I love it so much. And shortly after the top coat moment, we are gonna go outside and walk the gorgeous it looks like it's a gorgeous summer day, summer day of Canada, and we are gonna show you what this looks like when the sun hits it, because we enter a completely other ethereal realm, realm when that light hits those nails, like it is out of the universe. I was so impressed, and again, like, I haven't used poly gel in quite some time and yeah if you guys enjoyed this please let me know because I want to do a lot more poly gel videos I really enjoyed the way the colors ombre and personally you cannot tell that this is poly gel this just looks like the perfect merge of colors like I was just so in love with how every everything ombre so yeah I'm really excited to know if you guys enjoyed this if you did then we will definitely be doing more poly gel videos so we are just finishing up with that top coat moment and we are gonna go out into them streets and get that sunlight. Now I did keep the natural sounds of nature as I took these gorgeous videos and pictures. 
I hope that my beautiful family enjoyed this video. I love you guys so much, and I cannot wait to see you in the next video. Mwah.